All right, hey there, Proxians. This is Proxify here, and guys, welcome back to another episode of the Renegade Platinum Let's Play. So, if you guys missed out in the last episode, we have basically uh, continued uh, throughout our way in the Victory Road area. We also went and spoken over to Marley. Also, did that uh, little kind of side battle uh, there with Marley, and uh, we kind of helped her out uh, to basically exit over here. I believe this is known as Route as uh, Route 224. Uh, this is where you can actually go and uh, find out where the Shaman is, and uh, if you actually do have the mystery event. I believe of Oak's letter, you can actually be able to go and uh, do some stuff here with the uh, stone tablet and actually access the way on where uh, Shaman is going to be located. But I don't think Dreano has ever uh, added that into there, but uh, anything could be possible because we haven't really uh, continued throughout uh, uh, a little bit further throughout uh, here in Victory Road because I know that we do have to go and take care of Dawn, uh, which that is going to be uh, somewhat uh, of our main type of thing that we have to do right now in Victory Road because we can't even go and take care of Davey yet, not until uh, a little bit later once we actually go and take care of dawn first but anyways hopefully uh, i hope you guys have yourself a great day out here for today and without further ado let's go and do a little bit of some team recap and uh let's see how everybody is doing out here so far so we got ourselves phantom at level 72 holding out with the bright powder does have aura sphere earthquake dragon pulse and also shadow shadow force we also do have HM Slave, of course, just here, just kind of just chilling, uh, just for uh, here with the waterfall, uh, so that we can be able to go to the Pokemon League. Uh, we actually do have Luffy at level 63 with the EXP share on. We actually do have Earthquake, Overheat, Flare Blitz, and also Close Combat. We also do have Shadow at level 62 with the Magnet that does have Crunch, Ice Fang, Wild Charge, and also Discharge. We also do have Queen, of course, at level 68, our second highest Pokemon out here so far, because I know that we had the EXP share on, on Queen for quite a while. That does actually have the Quick Claw, does have Earthquake, Surf, Toxic spice and also poison tail now speaking about surf i will be actually heading back over to pastoria city because if i'm not mistaken there is a mystic water item that we can go and pick up but i don't know adriano kind of moved that item around and unfortunately we can't pick uh, pick that up but we'll uh, go and check that out a little bit later uh once uh, before we actually go and take care of davy uh we also do have poke at level 65 with the lucky egg on that does have moon blast nasty plot flight and also drain kiss and I believe that is basically everybody on the team. So yeah, so all we have to do now is just go take care of Dawn and then uh, basically start doing some other stuff. So let's go and do it. So hi Prox, are you ready to battle? Uh, well, of course, there's no other way to put it because that guy is forcing us to literally go and battle you, Dawn. I can't even go and access the Pokemon League and I'm so afraid about what type of levels that you're gonna be having right now. Fantastic, so let's go and get started. Oh geez. What are we gonna get ourselves into this time? Please don't tell me that you're gonna have level 70 Pokemon with you or else this is gonna be really scary. Oh my god, well that is very close actually, that's level 69. Um, now we actually got ourselves Alakazam, I'm a little bit terrified for that, but I know that we have Shadow Force, so I think we should be alright, ouch! Okay, disappear. Okay, that should be able to just one-shot that Alakazam, no problem. Level 73 for Phantom, let's go and do it. Okay, not bad. Got ourselves like a Fable, alright, now that should be fine because that should be in our wheelhouse for Queen. Because the good thing is, is that Queen is at level 68, so I don't know if Poison Tail is going to be doing a lot of damage or not on this Clefable. Okay, I'm going to fast forward out here a little bit. Ooh, that was very close. Oh, come on. No, a full restore. Oh, I could have went for a Toxic Sparks right there. Ooh, hey, actually speaking about getting poisoned right there, that's pretty nice. So at least uh, that Leftovers is not going to really uh, do Clefable any justice. Uh... I could set up for Toxic Spikes if I'm lucky enough. Ooh, nice. And with the Quick Call to be popped. Okay, you know what? I'm alright with that because you know what? A Poison Tail should kind of just go and do it. That's some justice there. Now, every time that uh, Donald's going to be setting out a Pokemon, it's going to get uh, Toxic Spiked out here. So that is very handy. Uh, now, we actually do have a Mammoth Swan coming. I could probably go and switch out to Luffy. I could go for an Overheat, a Flare Blitz, or I could go for an Earthquake. I don't think Earthquake's going to do that much. Close Combat, I don't think that's going to do that much either. Maybe an Overheat? Because, like, I don't want to, like, lower my special defense, because I think that's what happens with Flare Blitz, and that would not be nice. But I think Special Attack, I think that should be okay if I set up for an Overheat, so let's do it. Oh, uh, God, that's a little bit scary. Ooh, that actually just one shot out in there. Oh, that's going to be an issue. Well, we do have Polka, so at least Earthquake's not going to do anything to us. Nice. So, one good Moon Blast should work. Take care of that. Get all the way up to level 66 out here. Nice, nice. Vaporeon. All right. This is, again, going to be perfect for Shadow and uh, for, for this. So, let's do it. Oh, we're slowly getting there, guys. 
Only three more battles left. Or three more Pokemon left, I should say, uh, throughout uh, Dawn's Pokemon. Nice. Okay, so poisoned and also uh, also lure with the attack. So that kind of works out really well. I think what I'm going to do is just go up for a wall charge. I don't really mind if I uh, take the hit. I think I should be all right. Oh, come on, dude. Really? Okay, you know what? I think that should be fine. Either way, if uh, if I'm going to be missing out wall charges, at least uh, this Vaporeon is going to probably die by the poison. So uh, we should probably go up for one more. I don't know if uh, Dawn's going to be having a few uh, full restores on our team, but I'm just going to just kind of play it safe out here. Okay, I'm going to play out for a... Oh, that little sneaky son of a... Oh, come on, dude. Really? Sleep talk? Ouch. Get out of here, dude. Nice. All right, also poisoned as well. Uh, we could go switch out right into poke out here for this time. Okay. Fly, let's go. Let's see what we can do out here. Yes. Come on. We got this. Ooh, that's a little bit scary. Not to worry. I think this could probably work. There. Okay, good job. Uh, now here comes up the scary Vaporeon once again. Uh, I could probably go for Shadow out here. Okay, here we go. I think one good wall charge could probably do it. Oh, sleep talk. Ouch. <gasps> wow, we were still alive. Uh, yeah, I kind of had to risk it for the biscuit there. So sorry, Shadow. But at least you took one for the team and uh, you killed out the Vaporeon. But not to worry. I got to revive with your name on it after once all of this is done. All right, we also got ourselves a low pony. This should not even be a problem. I think what good Orisphere should work because I think you're also normal type. There you go. Nice. Almost done. I'll set up for some more agilities, but there we go. It's basically useless. Oh, thank God. Dawn is out of here. Oh, and we don't even get any money still from her. So, wow, Prox, you really grew into a great trainer. It's amazing that you think that, uh, think you didn't even own a Pokemon when I met you. You're definitely ready to challenge the Pokemon League now, so good luck, Prox. I know that you could do it. So, I wonder, can I do anything with the stone tablet? I want to see. So, the surfaces are marked as polished just like a mirror. So, yeah, unfortunately, we do need to have Oak's letter to basically do what we need to do. Uh, but that's all right. You know what? We'll just go and fly all the way back to Pastoria City before we go. Oh, well, actually, hold on. No, 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 no. We're not going to do Pastoria City right now because I don't really feel like having to go and return all the way all, all the way back to where the Pokemon League is and have to literally restart everything. So, no. We made it this far. I don't really want to have to go all the way back. Okay, here we go. Dragon Pulse. I should do some justice right here. Ooh, Dragon Dance already? Get out of here, dude. Ouch. Okay. There you go. Let's see it's gone. Oh, great. A Salamis. This is perfect. Uh... Heal up as fast as you can. I didn't really want to have to go and face off with this dragon tamer, but I guess I have to. Ouch! Okay, this is not good. Oh, come on, man. Really? Well, at least you're confused, so I can just go and just set up for, uh, for revive as quickly as possible. I'll go right back into Phantom. There. Ooh, he's got dragon dance again. Okay. You have to be very careful with this, because uh, this Salamis could go absolutely ape shit if we're not careful. Ouch! Oh, thank God you're poisoned. Wait. Woo. No, but that's plus two. That's going to be a problem. That's going to kill me. Yeah. Again, dude. Uh, you know what? I think I just have to just go and just basically use up all my revives out here. Just kind of let this Salamis just basically die because, like, there's no other way. Okay. Uh, HO Slave. Just gonna go and throw in another revive. Uh, you freaking annoying Ace Trainers out here. Oh, nice. You actually hurt yourself. Good job. Okay. Just go for a max potion. Gonna heal up my Phantom there. Ooh, all right, already down and out. Uh, well. I guess I'm just going to set up for another one. Uh, no, it's going to kill me, probably. Yep, I thought so. Oh my god, really? And you're still alive. Just go away, dude. No more outraging anymore. Just hurt yourself again. There. Okay, finally, you're dead. 
Just get out of here, dude. Our Kingdra. This is just nice. Now, this Kingdra, again, may probably have Dragon Dance as well. Oh, this is not good at all. Go for a shadow force or something. There you go. No, 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 no. Ooh. Ooh. That was very close. Just go for a max potion. Just hurt yourself, Kingdra, please. Okay, well, at least you went for a waterfall. You kind of just, uh, thrown your own move. So that's good enough. Thank you. Goodbye. And goodbye, Dragonite. See you later. Oh, what? Oh, no. D dance. Ah! Oh my god, really? Thanks, man. Now I have to literally restart all the way back at the freaking poke or, or, or well, back over at the uh, Victory Road area. Damn it. <laughs> well, thanks a lot to that Ace Trainer. Uh, I'm all the way back here at the very beginning, and you know what? While I am here, we should probably just go right down to Pastoria then. I do not want to face with that Ace Trainer anymore. Or, 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 or not Ace Trainer, but the uh, Dragon Tamer. Oh, because, like, uh, the crazy thing is is that, like, uh, those, those Dragon Tamer sprites are, like, exactly like Ace Trainers. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh, wait, hold on. Whoop, where am I going? I went a little bit too far. Because the Mystic Water, I think, is, like, literally located right over at where, um, where Crasher Wake's place is. Hold on. Run! Run as fast as you can. Right down here. I remember when I first uh, played uh, Pokemon Plano, I never really thought that there was anything going to be down in this way, but yeah, if you go across to where these boats are, there is a uh, secretive item that you can actually go and pick up, which this is uh, hopefully going to be a vanilla mystic water, which that would be somewhat handy. Hey, there we go. Vanilla mystic water, and that's still there. Um, now I actually do want to give that over to, uh, over to Queen. Because that could actually help us out a little bit with the, uh, okay, there we go. Replace up the Quick Claw. And I think, uh, who would actually want to have the Quick Claw? Maybe Luffy? I think we'll do that. There. I, w I, I am basically to go and do some, uh, some off-record grinding as well, too, so... I may probably put the EXP share back on, but damn it, man. I have to go and literally restart all the way back over here. But the good thing is, is that we already went and uh, battled out all the different trainers that were in this spot, so we don't really have to worry about anything too much. We can just kind of just yeah, fast forward from here. Ah, here we go. Whoa. Okay, I'm a little bit nervous about this. I'm going to probably do a little bit of a quick save. We found out where this portal is going to be. I think we're not even going to even bother about doing this as a post-game type of thing. I'm going to do it right now. Just so that since we are here. So is this going to be... So it's a rift across time and space. You can feel scorching embers passing through the other side. Do you want to link to the other side with the red chain? So is this like another like type of distortion world type of area or something? Through the red chain into the rift. Oh, man. Who is this? Is this like Maltrace or something? What is this? It is Maltrace. Interesting. No, this is gonna be a, an awesome battle if I can actually go and capture this. Okay. Um. Now, what to start off with? I could probably set up a Moonblast. I don't know if Moonblast is gonna do a lot. Or Drain and Kiss. I could probably do a Drain Kiss. Okay, that's, that doesn't do a lot. We would set it up for a Sky Attack, which I think we should be all right with that. Ooh, nice, it missed. What a good job. Um, I think I could do one more. Uh, okay. Ooh. Sky attack. Ooh, that's a little bit scary. Um, it's too bad that I don't have Milo out here, because then I would have been able to, like, uh, hypnosis the Moltres out here. Quick ball. No, it didn't even work. Uh, that was a bad idea. Ouch. Okay, who else can I basically send out for this one? Because I know that I think Hurricane is, I think Hurricane is like a fly type move or a dragon type move. So probably set out Queen. I'm just gonna chuck out all my Ultra Balls at this thing. Come on, we can capture this. No, uh, this is not good. 
I'm gonna throw out a few of these. Oh, it's got roost? Okay, now I may probably need to run away from that, because that's just annoying. Oh. Okay, I'm sorry, Moltres. <laughs> that was just a little bit too annoying right there. You had roost? All that all that attacking for literally for nothing? No, I'm out of there. <laughs> no. Okay, I'm gonna head up onto this one though. And let's go and keep on heading forward. Get ourselves that Davy fight though. And I think I'm ready. Okay, up the waterfall this time. And I think we should probably go and bring back out Esper and uh, probably set the uh, EXP share up on her because uh, I know that we're kind of low right now on the on the levels for Esper right now at the time. And I should probably go and buy some uh, full restores and some max potions and other good necessities because we've been kind of wasting out quite a bit of those. Okay, so Bebe's PC. And let's go and... Take out Bibberol. It has been fun while it lasted, Bibberol, but thank you. Okay, there we go. Esper. Ah, well, Esper's at level 59. It's not too bad. And uh, I think, yeah, so let's just go and give out the EXP share on. And I think we should be good. There. Oh, wait, hold on. I think I didn't even give it out to it yet. He's already holding out the amulet coin. Oh, okay. Well, I don't think we need to really worry about the amulet coin anymore, because we already have, like, enough money as it is. I want to see how much money that we have already. Wow, 250,000 Poké Dollars. That's insane. Okay, now, full restores. I think I could probably go for those. Let's see, how many am I going to pay out for? Maybe just go out for, like, 40 of these? No, I don't want to go out too much. There we go. That's fine enough. Any revives though, we need a whole bunch of these. I know that we're gonna be in desperate need for those. Uh, full heals, we should probably pick up one of those as well too, while we're at it. Okay, and I think we are good. I think we are good for this uh, Davy fight now. Yep, okay, let's do it. Where are you gonna be? So hold it, don't go off without me. You're challenging the Pokemon League, aren't you? So that's why I'm here too. So let's see who's more worthy of making the challenge with the battle. All right, let's go and do this. Let's see what is Davey gonna be starting off with here first. Set up for a Star Raptor, okay. Should've just went literally right into uh, the shadow out here for this one. Ugh, okay. Well, at least that didn't do too much. Set up for another Brave Bird. Okay, that's good enough. There. Okay, so Shadow, so Shadow already knocked out Star Raptor. And here comes out Snorlax. Um, I could probably just set up for Phantom, or I can go into Luffy. Let's go into Luffy first. I don't know if a close combat is going to do that much. Uh, yeah. That's not good. Okay, I think it's Phantom's turn. Let's go set up for Aurora Sphere. That should hopefully knock it out. Oh, it's got slack off too. Uh, this is not good. Ooh, it's got curse as well. Oh god. Okay, we need to go as fast as possible to knock this thing off. Dude, just get out of here. Oh, this is one annoying Snorlax. No, this thing is gonna be cursing. And it doesn't even affect either. Oh, we're gonna be out here for a while, guys. Oh, this is not good. Yeah, I thought so. And plus this thing also has leftovers too, which that's also another big problem. Yes! Okay, no, 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 no. Come on, just knock this thing out. Oh, thank God. Woo. Good job, Poka. Good job, Poka. Okay, so uh, Empoleon is going to be coming out. I guess I could just switch on out from here. And then just out for a... Uh, Except for a max potion, and I think we should be good for the long run. Flash cannon. Okay, did do a lot. Okay, got ourselves our own wild charge. Nice. So, Polya still gets knocked out from the wild charge. 
Uh, hair across. Um, I think we could just probably just go and switch right out into poke out here. And we could just go for a max potion. Set that up. Ooh. Okay, well, at least uh, hair across is poison now. No! Oh. Well, that's just annoying. Okay, we need to set for a psychic. Then! Holy crap, dude. Okay, that is just very terrifying now. This hair cross is literally not playing around. Okay, go for that immediately. Uh, well. I could just go and waste off on some of my max potions and just kind of let this hair cross kind of lower himself down a little bit. Um, but also too, I think as well, Mega Horn doesn't really have a lot of PP left. Ooh, that's that's actually pretty nice. Cause I think Mega Horn only has like five. Okay, so now it's got ourselves some Stone Edge. Ooh, watch out go for our own Earthquake out here for this one. Nice, nice. All right, Arcanine. Well, we do have that Mystic Water already set up on here, so this should be good a, a little bit for us. Flare Blitz out. Okay. That Poison Point is really coming in handy, dude. I have to say that. So good job on Queen. That Poison Point is always landing. Jeez. All right, there you go. We don't even have to even worry about anything all that too much. This poison point and then also with the flare blitz. Nice. Arcanine's already down and out. We can go and take that level right now. Sweet. Level 69. Okay. Breloom. I think this is a perfect time to send out for Polka out here for this one. Okay. Let's fly up in the air. Ooh. Another stone edge. Bye bye, dude. Give me that level. There we go. Level 67 for Polka. And there, that is how we do it, guys. We defeated both Davey and also Dawn in this episode. And I think that's all that I want to do. We'll save out on the Elite Four for the next episode. So darn it, you watch it, though. I'll get tougher and win my way through the Pokemon League because I'm going to become the champion and the toughest trainer. Crocs, you better not lose to anyone before me. Oh, man. I am so nervous for what this Elite Four is going to be. Now, also, too, I just want to let you guys know that if I do actually die throughout here in the Elite Four, uh, I may probably not continue throughout Renegade Platinum because I don't really want to have to go and literally restart through everything and kind of have to blow out more money than I have to because I already kind of did that already uh, for their first attempt out here with our Elite Four. So I don't think I even have a lot of money because I think I only have like 90,000 or so left. Yeah, we only have like 90,000, and I don't really want to feel like trying to rebuy out more items than I have to do if I'm going to die out here. But also, too, I will be doing some off-record battling in the process because I'm pretty certain, I think, if I'm not mistaken, uh, Cynthia's team is sitting around, I think, around like level 75, maybe level 80, I think. So I think I'm a little bit nervous with that, so I'll, I'll try and uh, boost up most of my team uh, to actually get all the way up to like level 71 or so. Because because uh, if, if we could try and stay around like at least like around the part where the Elite Four is going to be, I think we shouldn't really have anything to like really worry about. So I'll, I'll try and uh, uh, boost up my Pokemon over to uh, like somewhere around like over level 70. So I'll see you guys uh, in the next one, and uh, don't forget to leave a comment, like, also subscribe. I'll see you guys then, and uh, and peace.